The vaccines that are doing the rounds and being administered here in Reading and in other parts of the country are really very effective. They're helping drive down the numbers of transmissions, the numbers of disease, the numbers of illness generally that we will see across the population. Now, when the pandemic started, we were told that this was really a disease of older people, but that's changed as the virus has evolved and we're seeing more cases, more incidences of younger people. That's why it's really important if you're offered the vaccine that you get it, that you take your opportunity to protect yourself, your friends, your loved ones. So lymphocytes are an important type of white blood cell and vital part of our immune system. And there are about a million million or a trillion lymphocytes in your body, but only a tiny number of these, a few, maybe 10 or even 100, can spot the very particular spike on the surface of the COVID-19 virus. And, you know, 100 cells can't do much, spread across the whole body. There's no suitable defense. So what's really remarkable is how fast these lymphocytes, these white blood cells, respond when you're vaccinated. Every day, one cell can grow to become nearly 10 cells, which means after a week, if you do the maths, they might have 1 million cells, but even a million cells isn't much spread around your body. By two weeks, you'll have a million times a million, so that's billions of cells swirling all around your body in all of the places that are needed, which is remarkable because that's exactly the length of time it takes for you to be protected. After a tiny scratch, less than one milliliter of vaccine, two weeks later, you've got billions of these virus-specific lymphocytes and your immune system is primed and ready to protect you. And the remarkable thing is that your body will remember. Um, however, we need to remind the immune system. So do make sure you grab that second dose, which will expand that immune response that you generated during your first dose. And it will make sure too that your immune response lasts as long as possible. Vaccines are safe and effective and everyone who is offered one should get one. We know it prevents transmission and we also know it reduces hospital admissions. It not only protects you from getting seriously ill, but it will also protect those around you who may be at greater risk of severe illness. It's important if you have any concerns or questions that you're able to ask those to a, to a healthcare professional who will be more than happy to answer any of your questions. The combination of getting vaccinated and following all other recommendations will help protect yourself and your families.